Good afternoon. Welcome to Hoyt's Kitchen. This afternoon I'm gonna make an old-timey meatloaf. So first of all I'm gonna wash my hands, make sure my hands are clean. Uh, always make sure your hands are clean and before you get started. recipe calls for a pound, pound or pound and a half of uh, ground chuck. I've got a pound of ground chuck. It uh, calls for one sleeve of crackers, fresh up. Calls for two eggs. Calls for a little salt and pepper. We're gonna put a dash. dash of salt and a couple of dashes of pepper. I like pepper. So, and it calls for a small onion. I don't know how I've made it without this chopper. Now this is the coolest thing it ever was. I got my I got my onion in there. And man, you put that onion in there and you pull this thing. I mean, that, that chops that onion up. It's ready. It's fine, it's fine chopped up. Look at there. Wow. It is fine chopped up. I don't see how I made it without one of those. So anyway. And where did you get that? That comes from Tupperware. So that's a Tupperware product. Yes, that's a Tupperware product. And it's got some blades in there, these things are sharp. I mean sharp, sharp. So anyway, you put uh, put your onion in there and now you <coughs> now you mix it all this together. And you got the chopper from Pam? Yes, I did. I got it from Pam. I'm gonna put me a spoon in this. Meatloaf is uh, easy to fix. It's, uh, you know, not as healthy as uh, fish to eat, but, uh, you know, meatloaf is a good dish. You can use turkey burger. Yeah, you can use turkey and uh, make people. it. A lot of people use turkey. Just as healthy. Alright, now I've got this mixed up pretty good. Now I'm gonna put I'm gonna put a half a cup of uh, ketchup. Half a cup of ketchup and a little milk. It says a quarter to a half a cup of milk, so I'm going to start with uh, about a quarter cup of milk. And then you continue to mix it up. And we're looking for a pasty Sticky consistency. Hasty consistency. Looks like we've uh, we've got that. So it's uh, 
I'd say it's pasty enough. Uh, then I've got a, a two quart dish here. Uh, I'm going to spray it with pan. Then I'm You're gonna, gonna go ahead you wanna put a little bit of water in that now or No, put the water in okay. later. So you put the uh, water in on top. Move it out, pretty level. And you put you some uh, ketchup on top. Then, you add a little water. Uh, the water takes up uh, some of the grease. Put a little water. It says halfway up the, mm -hmm. but I put about a quarter of an inch of water. So I've had my oven preheated to 350. So uh, it goes in the oven at uh, 350 for one hour. So it's so. Uh, four forty-three. At five forty-three, we'll take it out and we'll show it to you then. All right, we're back with the meatloaf. Been an hour, been in an oven, cooking for an hour. So we're fixing to take it out and see what it looks like. Oh, yummy, look at there. Look at that good look. Look at that good meatloaf. Look at there. You want me to show them what it looks like inside? Sure. Well, uh, we'll cut it. Uh, my recipe said cut it in half. I don't know why, but we cut it in half, and then I'm gonna cut a piece off of the end here good and moist. Oh yeah. Didn't stick anywhere. Oh yeah. Ooh. Look at that meatloaf. Yes. All right. I'm not going to taste of it, but uh, I'm going to say it's going to be pretty good. You folks keep watching, and I'll keep cooking. Thank you.